kiongozi wetu rais wa jamhuri ya Kenya daktari William Samoe Ruto waziri wetu mkuu mheshimiwa Musalia Mudavari waziri mkuu wa zamani mheshimiwa Raila Odinga LKA Agwambo makasisi wetu familia ya field marshal Dedan Kimadhi Wachuri na Mukami Kimadhi adwa nyumba yetu gai ni moyaga na hidi sio the geje ishara ya mwadhani ya gosho mheshimiwa rais tunakushukuru sana kwa kumpa mama huyu wetu heshima kirasmi na kukupatia maumau na watoto wao heshima inasitahili mazishi ya leo inasimamiwa na kanisa na serikali na maumau kwa hivyo mimi kwanza nitaongea kama mtoto ya maumau baadaye nitaongea kama naibu wa rais na ikiwezekana nitaongea kama rigiji wapi kijana yetu ya hapa anaitwa Kwame Kwame kuja wapi Kwame karibia hapa taarisha ile wimbo unajua tu, tulianza hii mazishi tuko na anthem yetu ya maumau na sasa ndio tuingie kwa ile ratiba ya maumau huyu kijana wetu atuongoze kwa ile anthem yetu tafadhali tusimame Asante sana Rais wetu William Ruto Nataka kuchukua nafasi hii kwa niaba ya wale walipigania uhuru katika msitu wa Badea na wa Mount Kenya na watoto wao 
na wale wote walikufa wakipigania uhuru wa nchi hii ni kushukuru rais kwa sababu wewe uliamua ya kwamba huyu mama wetu ambaye alikuwa pale mstuni akipigania uhuru ambaye aliwachwa na bwana yake ambaye aliuawa na wameberu ukaamua serikali yako impatie heshima apate mazishi ya kitaifa na serikali yako ikasimamia kila kitu kwa hii mazishi rais kwa niaba ya watu ya maumau na watoto wao tunasema asante sisi rais tuko na furaha kwa sababu serikali zimepita zimekosa kutambua watu ya maumau The Mau Mau story is about land and freedom. Mau Mau ilikuwa naitwa the land and freedom army. Na hao watu ya Mau Mau walipigana. Mzungu akiwa na gruleti, akiwa na bombs, akiwa na buduki. They had only a panga and a resolve to liberate their country. Uhuru kapatikana lakini mashamba haikupatikana. The British government gave 30 million pounds for land to be bought from settlers to settle the Mau Mau and their descendants. But the black colonialists who came after the white colonialists left diverted that money. That land was taken by a few and given to home guards and collaborators. Na nimeshukuru sana former prime minister umekubaliana na sisi ya kwamba mashamba ya maumau ilichukuliwa na home guards and collaborators miguuda ya maumau hiyo ilionega ti na kama timu na tukunia na tungetaka former prime minister kushukuru babako marehemu jaramogi kwa sababu he spoke about land grabbing from our Mau land na akaumizwa kwa kuongea juu ya mashamba ya Mau Mau tungekataka kukuomba kwa heshima waziri mkuu wa zamani ukitetea wa Kenya kwa mambo zingine zote vile wanaendelea tunataka kusikia pia utetee hao watu warudishiwe mashamba yao na wale walichukua na muda wajua warudishie hao mashamba yao kadi wadwa itu Did you know that? No wonder Mau Mau yo iruo eria ga thwariga. Na yo Mau igadiko tuvuli twa muige. Koguo wale wanasema ati serikali nunue mashamba ni sawa. Lakini mashamba ya Mau Mau iko. Na inajulikana pahali iko. Si wale wako nayo warudisha hata kama ni nusu. Eh, na tutetee hiyo. Even as we ask the government to look for money to buy land for Mau Mau, the land for Mau Mau is known where it is. Those who took this land, they can be considered and give us at least half of that land. And it is enough for the Mau Mau. Hiyo shaba ni kubwa, inaweza tosha hawa na watoto yao. Your Excellency. Kwa sababu, we feel bad. We feel bad. We feel cheated and we feel misused because our parents were buried having gotten nothing. Yet the collaborators of the home guards continue to enjoy everything the Mau Mau people fought for. And they despise us and they look down upon us. Yet the vast lands they occupy belong to the Mau Mau and their descendants. And that is the truth. And I'm happy the former Prime Minister, you have said we speak the truth. Welcome to the Club of Truthful Men. It is true. The truth is good. It sets you free. Ukweli ni kwamba, bei ya unga yuko juu. Ukweli pia ni kwamba, when the hardship government was there, Unga ilikuwa tufate, imeteremuka ni 170, hamu kufanya maandamano. That is the truth. That is the truth. 
Ukweli ni kwamba tumekuta uchumi umeharibika pesa yote ya serikali ilibiwa ikapelekwa kwa project ya BBI that is the truth the truth of the matter pesa ilibiwa ikapelekwa kwa project ya Simio that is the truth it is good for us to be truthful ukweli ni kwamba pia people must not live in denial the truth of the matter is that hustler number one, William Samoe Ruto is the president of Kenya and commander in chief of the defense forces. That is the truth. That is the truth. And his deputy is the son of Baumau Rigiji. That is the truth. Let us stop living in denial. Let us be truthful. And once the truth we accept it, ukweli ni kwamba uchaguzi uliisha the next election is 2027 wale wa Kenya walipiga kura hakuna pahali walienda si wako wenye kupigiwa kura siko that is the time to sort out all those things those that is the truth so let us be truthful and let us tell each other the truth because it's the right thing to do tuko na apology ya CS wetu Rebecca Meano mtoto wetu kutoka hapa Ndaragwa na tuko pia na apology ya kiongozi wetu katika bunge la kitaifa mheshimiwa Kebani Ichongo pia hapa tuko na magavana wetu wa zamani wapigiwe makofi governor Kememia Mzea tuko pia na governor William Kabogo tupigie makofi Adwa nyumba ito mwego huko Mwekuo ni mwake na nikuona mudhabaki wetu. Huyu wita Waruto. Ni we mwadhurire. Kuyeda laka akuli ingiririo. Eh? Na ni ni nyenda kadona kam kam weke gachoki ya gadho adwa itu. Ni na ajabu na ita Waruto ni mwatu ikire wega. Ketu wali ohawama. Ito tia ni hadu wega. Tani da ni hadu hacheke. Na ni mwatu ikire wega. Mugitu hoya la gaya gitu teidia mugishoka mugitu ikiria kura ona ore mwaga ya kuligiririo mukiuga muti kuligiririo adu anyuba yitu adu haja beno eta woruto na nie mwene kuma goroide akwa theine amukira igatho ciakwa ore gya adu anyuba yitu kuma goroide akwa theine amukira igatho ciakwa Rais wetu tungekuomba kwa heshima usikize kilio cha Maumau. Hao wazee wanasema wanajua pahali kimadhi alizikwa. Rais kwa mapenzi yako ukikubali uwapatie nafasi watuoneshe pahali yuko kimadhi alizikwa kama atapatikana tumpatie mazishi ya heshima. Pia rais nilikuwa hapa siku ya Jumapili katika ibada na Wakristo wale walikuwa na huyu mama wetu wakaomba mimi na wewe kwa sababu wanajua sisi ni watu ya kujenga makanisa wakasema rais tuwasaidie hiyo kanisa mama alipeana shamba mimi na wewe na viongozi tusaidie kujenga hiyo kanisa na rais i want to encourage you uendelee kujenga kanisa hata wengine wakipiga kelele ati kanisa itakani kujengwa wachana na hiyo maneno rais wewe isipokuwa ni Mwenyezi Mungu huge kuwa rais ile jama ulikuwa umepangiwa na system na deep state na machifu na kila mtu rais Mwenyezi Mungu ndiye alikusaidia kwa hivyo ni, ni muhimu ukipata nafasi urudi kwa nyumba la Bwana ukuje usaidie we viongozi wetu ya kanisa msikuwe na wasiwasi Kenya iko na uhuru wa kuabudu. Na hatutaki kwa sababu kulifanyika jabu kidogo ya watu wawili. Tulaumu kanisa ya Kristo. Tunataka kama iko shida mtu alaumiwe na jina lake. Unajua sasa shetani na wafuasi yake wanatumia hii kuhujumu kanisa la Kristo. Na shetani unajua halali. Sasa makasisi wawili wamepatikana pale wamenatumia kanisa kufanya mambo yao hao watachukuliwa tu kama binadamu wawili 
lakini kanisa la Kristo wahubiri wetu wakasisi wetu ni watu ya maana 99.9% of our pastors and reverends are men of faith and good people. I want to ask the Church of Christ to give us a chance to, to isolate the 0.1% to put it away from the Church of Christ. Na msikuwe na wasiwasi. Najua shetani halali na wafuasi wake na ni wengi. Kwa hivyo kanisa tuko imara rais nikimalizia Ningetaka ni kuwakishia kwamba uliniagiza ni kuja hapa katika Central Province ile ya zamani kaunti yetu ya Nyandarwa, Kirinyaga, Muranga, Nyeri na Kiambu ambayo ime, ilikuwa imelaliwa zaidi na pombe haramu na bangi. Na rais ningetaka ni kujulisha ya kwamba machifu wetu, polisi, viongozi wote tumeshikana na kazi hapa inaendelea vizuri na pombe inapungua bangi inapungua na kutoka hapa tutaenda pande ya Nakuru tusaidie Rift Valley kutoka hapo tuende pande pande ya Pwani kwa hivyo rais katika area hii hii ya Central Kenya tulikupenda wewe kwa sababu wewe ni mcha Mungu na wewe ni mcha kazi and we did not make a, a decision just like that we analyzed critically because we are intelligent people na tumekula vitabu kidogo kidogo tumesoma hapa na pale tukaangalia and we were satisfied that you have what it takes to move this country to the next level and so far umetupeleka vizuri nimeona magazeti watu wakipiga kelele ati umeweka wakikui wengi kwa serikali yako walikuwa nataka twende wapi sasa mimi nauliza tukiwa wengi kwa serikali ya Ruto iko makosa wale wanasema tuko wengi kwa serikali ya Ruto sisi pia ndio tuko wengi kamete prison kwa nini waseme tufunguliwe tuende nyumbani your excellency we are in your government by choice and by arrangement we made a conscious decision to vote for you because you have voted takes to run this country And it cannot be ati ya kwamba wakikuyu hapa wachache wakiweko wa serikali mnasema ni ukabila. Sisi tumefungwa tumejaa pale kamiti. Hakuna mtu analamika ati wakikuyu ni wengi wafunguliwa ende nyumbani. You are excellency wale umeweka kwa serikali yetu tunashukuru. Endelea kuweka wengine. Kama mtu yuko anaweka na serikali ni. Eh na sisi si ni kura yetu ni mingi pia. Si tulipigia huyu rais William Ruto? Yes. Nyinyi kama hakupigia yeye it's up to you. Sisi busituzija kwa mambo yenu. Sisi This is what Chapa Kazi. He has analyzed and found that in this region there are men and women who can assist him to govern. And we are in that government by choice. And the president has done nothing wrong in asking us to come and help him to run government. Kwa hivyo watu wawachana na sisi sisi tulipiga kura tukaamuka mapema tukijua nini tunafanya. Kama mti kwenda tuikalie huko tuikalie hapo hapo. Tuikalie huko. Kwa hiyo ni ndio dake na atimia mwe tayari na gemitu wa mkera mdamaki. Rwabere. Rwakere. Rwagatatu. Rwakana. Rugama itwa mukere mudamaki wa bururi wa Kenya Karibu mheshimiwa rais